so after studying about the definition of the vector product or the cross product in the previous video and the mathematical formula is this as you can see let's understand the different cases case 1 for our study is when either of a vector or b vector or both are 0 if this is the case that either of a vector or b vector or both of them are 0 then what will happen then definitely this n cap the unit vector is not well defined because we have no clear idea about the plane and everything so this is not well defined hence definitely the cross product is coming out to be 0 right the next case if I talk about definitely different cases can be formed out but we will be taking only two important cases. The next case is when I have theta as 0 degree that means the angle between the vectors is 0 degree. So theta is 0 again sin 0 is 0 so definitely a cross b is 0. Again here we do not have any clear idea about the unit vector n cap. So this is the two important cases and one more thing very clear why is it always called as vector product because here we are concerned with the direction so either you will read it as vector product or you will read it as cross product because of the placement and positioning of the cross except dot in this case.